Hi, Todd Warren here in the Forecast Center with a look at our weather week ahead and getting off to a bit of a soggy start this Friday afternoon. As you can see from the Arklatex weather cameras, lots of clouds, pretty good round of rain moving through downtown Shreveport right now. And we will continue to see the areas of rain basically move from south to north and that that rain likely will decrease as we go through the evening and nighttime hours tonight. Here's a look at the overall weather pattern. You can see the upper level low been talking about for the past several days starting to make that march towards the north and east and it should be uh, to our north by tomorrow then we'll see this kind of settle into the southeast southeastern sections of the country once it moves to our east it will bring in some much drier air thanks to a cold front that'll move through the area more than likely saturday night and sunday morning you can see the frontal system from tomorrow evening through the day sunday gradually moving through the region we will see it to pretty much wrap up any hope of rain sunday as we likely will close sunday with some sunshine over most of the area so this is how it looks on uh, for the next couple of days from robin's toyota futurecast you can see the scattered showers and thunderstorms which uh, have been basically most numerous over the south west and northern sections of the area elsewhere a bit more scattered we'll see that rain decrease tonight and then tomorrow I expect uh, more scattered showers and thunderstorms to develop as the cold front gets closer to us that rain also will decrease some tomorrow night even as the front moves in you can see a few showers trying to develop along the front Sunday morning uh, we're gonna have a very narrow window mainly over the southeastern half of the area of uh, seeing some rain Sunday morning and then we'll see some sunshine make its way back to the area Sunday afternoon which should warm us up into the mid to upper 80s to close the weekend this is what it looks longer uh, what it looks like longer range as you can see the uh, upper level low to our west notice that as we move forward it will move to our north by tomorrow evening then it pushes uh, towards the south and east and kind of settles over the southeastern sections of the country it'll kind of sit here for a day or two and then finally move off towards the north and east and get replaced by an upper level ridge which should warm us up by the end of next week now before we dry out we are still looking at the possibility for some decent rain over parts of the area it does look like the rain will be somewhat uh, scattered so pretty good variation in the rainfall potential across the region some areas may see less than a quarter of an inch some folks may see two three inches and it looks like the chance for heaviest rain or the the heaviest rain will be highest over the northwestern half of the area where a lot of that rain is falling right now over the course of the next 24 hours here's a look at your forecast for tonight again the rain will decrease we will stay mostly cloudy if you're headed to a high school football game this evening for this Friday evening may want to take along the umbrella just to be on the safe side as temperatures will fall into the upper 60s to low 70s tonight and then tomorrow another pretty good chance for scattered showers or thunderstorms across the area with daytime highs mainly in the upper 70s to low 80s with the coolest air across the northern part of the region we will see a little bit warmer temperatures Sunday despite the fact that the cold front moves through we're likely going to begin Sunday with uh, lows in the upper 60s to low 70s but with that afternoon sunshine which is expected daytime highs will climb into the mid to upper 80s will kind of settle into the middle 80s for highs for most of the work week lows will drop to the low 60s pretty close to normal and then we will warm up by next weekend and notice once the rain chances end Sunday uh, looks like another solid week of dry weather here for the Oracle text that could last through next weekend and into the beginning of the following week. So all in all, it looks like I uh, need to keep the umbrella handy uh, through probably Sunday morning, and then we'll see some sunshine return that will stick around through pretty much all of next week.